scientific studies dealing with the diseases of man were made by the Public Health Service as early as 1886. These studies have gradually expanded until today the research of the Public Health Service on the cause, method of spread, and means of prevention of disease is among the most important work that it performs. A research laboratory for the Public Health Service, called the Hygienic Laboratory, was established in 1901. In 1930, Congress changed its name to the National Institute of Health. At this famous institute in Washington, D.C., most of the investigative work of the Public Health Service is conducted. The diseases and conditions studied by the service include a long list. Heart disease is public enemy number one. It is first on the list of the causes of death. More than 300,000 persons die each year in the United States from this cause. The electrocardiograph has aided greatly in the study and diagnosis of heart disease. Next in importance as a cause of death is cancer. This disease results in the death of about 135,000 people in the United States annually. Malaria is still an important public health problem in at least 16 states of the Union. This mosquito-borne disease exacts a toll of sickness of more than two million cases annually. This patient is having a malarial chill. The fight against malaria is the fight against the malaria mosquito. The prevention of mosquito breeding by seeing that no containers are left lying around to catch and hold water and thus provide breeding places for mosquitoes and by eliminating all refuse piles insofar as possible. In certain regions, effective mosquito control has been accomplished by dusting water areas with a poisonous mixture. This dusting is done from trucks, by hand dusting machines, and by airplanes, according to the conditions met with. Another effective method employed is the killing of larvae or wiggle tails by the oiling of stagnant water. Other preventive measures include ditching for drainage and keeping mosquitoes out of the home by screening. 